Good afternoon, everybody. Colin here with TechOut. Today we're going to be taking a uh, look at iOS 13.4 Beta 1. I didn't do a video when this initially came out, um, and that was because I'm actually using my iPhone um, a little bit as a daily driver now. So I figured I would just wait and do a review on it after I've used it for a couple days. Um, my Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus is taking a little break while I um, enjoy my iPhone 11 Pro Max a little bit. Mainly because I've been reviewing some other products that are going along with this, but we'll get into those later. Um, has nothing to do with this video right now, but iOS 13.4 has some new features, um, nothing that you'll really see, um, but they did add a new thing to uh, CarPlay, which isn't something you'll see. It is called Key, um, Car Key, I think, or Key Kit or something like that, if I remember correctly. I don't know the exact name of it, but it basically uses NFC, um, and on certain cars, they, have, they don't have any that support it yet, I don't think. Um, but it will be something that will be coming to certain cars um, in the future where you can use your iPhone to unlock, start, um, and drive, not drive your cars and physically drive it, but you can use your, your phone as the key basically using um, NFC and CarPlay and everything like that. It integrates with Apple Wallet for the key, um, which will be very cool to see how that works so you can use your phone for basically everything. Um, also kind of scary because if your phone dies or something happens to your phone, you're basically stuck without your car unless you have a backup key. I mean, I guess you could keep something in your wallet uh, or something like that of that nature just in case. But for added convenience, you would be able to unlock it um, and start it and everything with your phone. Don't have too many details on that yet. It was just something that they saw in the update of iOS 13.4. So as more details come along with that, I will update you guys in future videos. Um, I don't think my car obviously is gonna support it because I have wired CarPlay um, and it's just CarPlay. There's no other wireless key or anything like that. I think you have to have the NFC um, unlock kind of stuff with the wireless key fobs, which I don't have. Um, so I won't be able to show you guys necessarily, but we'll, we'll talk about it later on in future videos once stuff like that comes out. As far as battery life and everything on iOS 13.4, I've had no issues. I've had my phone unplugged all day. It was only charging on the way home for about five minutes um, on my wireless charger in my car, um, and I'm at 84%. I didn't use my phone a little bit throughout the day, not too much, but battery drain is not a big issue in iOS 13. I haven't had any issues with it um, really in any of the betas that I've been a part of. Signal is still pretty good. As you can see, I only have one bar right now, but one to two bars, unless I'm actually using LTE, is pretty normal for um, my area with uh, T-Mobile and my phone. If I actually disconnect from the Wi-Fi and my phone's trying to do stuff over LTE, my bars usually go up to three or four, um, depending on usage. So I guess it just depends on the state your phone's in. Right now I am connected to Wi-Fi, so not too much of an issue. Everything else, no app crashes, no anything like that. Been working fine, no app compatibility issues that I've had with the apps that I'm using. Um, been running very smoothly. Um, no, Like I said, no new features or anything like that to show you guys, no new wallpapers or anything crazy. Um, and I don't expect there to be, it, we're on 13.4 right now. Um, iOS 14 is going to be coming around in beta in around, right around the corner in June, um, and then released you know, September, October to the public. So not going to see any major new features in iOS 13. They're just going to continue to fix bugs and stuff like that. So when we go over to iOS 14, they don't carry anything extra over um, and have any issues and stuff like that. I'm Colin with TechOut. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, have a great day.